Hey guys, it's Lena from the Land of Gods, and we are doing the monthly map spread for the sign of Pisces, my fishy fish, fish, sun, moon, rising, and Venus. Guys, this is for the month of September, but please do remember the time is fluid, energies can be reversed, and this is, of course, a general reading. So please take what resonates and leave the rest for others to receive. If you are here for the first time, welcome aboard. Welcome to my channel. And if you've been kind enough to come back, thank you so very much, my fishies. Welcome back, fishies. We are ready. There you go. That was the last shuffle. Let's jump straight into the reading. Whoa. And man cards want to speak like how we are starting with the ace of waters ace of cups which is absolutely gorgeous for your fellow water sign scorpios we started with the ace of waters too there is a lot of love coming in loves a lot of love wonderful beginnings six of fire wow love and success your way pisces look at you going oh my god lovely energy to start with whoa we have a jumper here page of earth there's a lot of learning coming your way whatever you are doing right now it makes you feel good and it comes along with a lot of learning lovely two of air there's quite a bit to uh, juggle with it seems like quite a bit to to work along with hmm whoa really i have not been able to shuffle this entire deck once properly <laughs> gods really really want to speak to you four of earth you are working through things pisces it seems like there is something that has come your way that is making you work quite a bit but it comes along with a, some sense of achievement that there's something productive that you are doing in life look five of earth from a period of dullness you are coming back to life you're coming back to spring there is something which was kind of hanging in the lull and now it's coming back to life and you are happy about it however with that four of earth i feel you are a little hesitant in enjoying this whatever that has come your way which is giving you quite a lot of joy don't be hesitant loves it is time to celebrate three of fire it is time to celebrate this newness this energy of love and success and learning that's beautiful seven of fire yeah this is i feel like an advice to you like be confident in what you are doing because what you are doing is absolutely fantastic three of air let go of that sense of doubt that you have because there is this sense of being pulled back a bit like let's not celebrate too early which is also sensible to do, but whatever feeling that you are having, some sense of little joy that you are finding in doing what you are doing, don't pull yourself back in that at least. What's more for this three of air, three of fire? We have three, three already. Give me some more towards, okay? Two of waters, look beautiful beautiful synergy of energy here beautiful alignment here with that ace of waters and two of waters some people might as well be you know having some new bonds not necessarily romantic i feel but some bonds that is making you feel the love around you no it could be romantic but not necessarily this is very much your energy here very very synchronized you're ve feeling very much in your skin happy to be where you are 
let us get some for the seven of fire what is it that the universe wants you to be confidently f moving towards what is it spirit some okay seven of waters you have enough and more so don't hesitate don't think that it's too early to celebrate i mean of course don't open the champagne of bottle i'm not saying celebrate to that level but just just know that you have enough and more there is no need for you to be confused there is no need for you to be you know hesitant or reluctant -uh. i understand why one would feel like that because you are coming out of this five of earth phase you know a dry phase a dry patch let's say and sometimes one doesn't want to jinx it in some way do some kind of reverse manifestation don't be scared okay don't be scared one more please to ooh. oh look at that hangman yeah this is a very pulled back energy that i feel here very pulled back energy eight of earth working through things working through things focused on the learning it's like as if you're fighting with yourself the heart and the mind the heart wants to celebrate the mind is like not yet not yet not yet we've just started we've just started relax take it easy chill no we started from the ace we have the two we have the three we have the four here we have the five we have the six we have the seven we have not yet reached <laughs> it seems like you're telling yourself we have not yet reached okay just 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 wait there's still an eight. Oh, we have we have eight here so nine and ten is just still a little more to go a couple of more steps to reach that top a part of you is like let me enjoy you know whatever i have achieved so far whatever i learned so far it feels good a part of you is like no nah, not yet not yet <laughs> let's see if we get a 10 and a 9 to complete the circle so that you can finally enjoy yourself ace of waters let's clarify the ace of waters a beautiful new beginning here talk about beautiful new beginning ace of wands here a beautiful creative loving energy this could be for some some one coming in with a lot of passion there is fireworks there is a immediate connection with somebody you might be dealing with a leo let us go where should we go let's go to the fire okay six of fire let's go towards the fire two of swords see this two of air two of swords coming in again you are like should i uh, already should i not there is a sense of i don't know maybe because heart and heart you're really feeling like you but you don't want to show it not to others but to your own self forget about <laughs> others you yourself don't want to um you know feel it fully how much you're enjoying learning whatever that you are doing there is a sense of reluctancy let's go to the four of coins that sense of hesitance that sense of reluctance that we have spirit please clarify the four of earth what is it that the universe is giving to my pisces to enjoy and my pisces are like oh uh, not yet <laughs> okay this one ten of one see you have a ten by the way we are just waiting for the nine for the circle to finish ten of one there is this sense of in some ways overburdening yourself with the with the learning part and not really enjoying the process i feel some of you doing this to yourself enjoy while you are learning there is no fun to learn like that is there we have the nine of swords you are scared that if you do enjoy yourself that you might go off track or something 
Hmm. Is that so? We have the nine. We have the circle completed, by the way. We have the nine of sword. <laughs> so we have from the from one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Your circle is complete. Whatever that you are working upon, my Pisces, it is going to reach its completion. You will be successful. That much i can tell you now if you want to stand in between you and your success or you and your joy that's up to you because you gotta move and for you to move you gotta balance yourself as i can feel here at the two of waters you are kind of aligned or you are being told to align yourself chariot you have to have that balance we have that two of air in some ways balancing you know and here as well you are all set to move forward with this learning but you seem to be as i said hesitant in moving forward because there are things that you want to have in perfect balance there is a perfectionist that we are talking about here three of fire let's go to the three of fire no i'm told to go to the five of earth first okay five of earth coming back to life from a very dull face towards a very happening place star look at that you are being blessed you are being blessed pisces such a wonderful wonderful card here you might be dealing with an aquarius as well by the way star coming up with this five of earth what i really really like about this card is you know this almost dried up tree angel coming back to life there is life there is you know light coming out of its body you know there is a sense of healing here as well so don't burden yourself there might be some kind of a burden that you are carrying like as if you have to prove yourself to somebody there is nobody that you have to prove yourself to except your own self that's it and every single day you are working hard towards learning and becoming a better version of yourself so give yourself that credit now i can go to the three of fire now i can go towards celebration okay look Ten of Cups. This is, yeah, sit with your family and friends and have some good times, you are told. Have some good time. Don't hold yourself back. Three of Air. Three of Air with the Three of Air. Three of Swords with Three of Swords. What is it that you're holding in your heart that is painful? There is a sense of something going on which is great but because you are holding something in your heart that is painful that pain is not allowing you to enjoy what's now presenting itself in your life what's happening right now there's something that you are holding back the reason why you are hesitant is because of this pain in your heart it's because of that two of waters let's go to this really beautiful beautiful energy it's you being you it's you in your element it's you being so supremely aligned this, this is what your angels want you to do and you're working hard towards that look we have the eight of pentacles again right there as an overall as well as for the two of waters you are focused very much so but at the same time very reluctant and hesitant because of this pain right here seven of fire wait a minute i'm told just go for this one more time three of air how do we deal with this spirit this is how we're going to deal with this page of swords and page of cuffs pages are new beginnings pages are messengers of new energies unfolding in our life so acknowledge that there is truth and love there is integrity there there is honesty there with yourself look at the situation don't run away from it and face your fear with honesty and love 
that's what it is face this pain deal with this do not box it okay this is something that is being a kind of a mental block for you to enjoy what's going on right now currently in your life thank you spirit this was kind of stuck in my head seven of fire seven of fire spirit why do we have seven of fire here with the four of pentacles look move ahead with confidence you got this you've got this Pisces whatever this is you do seven of waters you've got enough and more on your platter seven of pentacles look we've got seven 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 here we do seven of fire with the seven of waters and seven of pentacles that's your number to look into that and we have three 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 as well three 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 seven 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 an entire cycle from one to ten this is perseverance this is also patience coming along with a hangman and seven of pentacles give yourself time to process this i am told this needs to be processed this needs to be addressed pisces whatever that you are not addressing that is in a way painful that you have pushed in the background in the forefront there's something really amazing going on but whatever is in the background is not allowing you to enjoy this to the fullest because you are worried that you're gonna mess it up somehow i do not know how but you are hanged man with the magician wow look at that two very very strong energies there and the nine of cups beautiful don't worry everything's gonna be fine you are focused you are working through things you are going to manifest this beautiful beautiful new beginning and completion for that matter you've got that ten of cups right there there would be reason for you to truly celebrate things what you need to do is look through things from an eye of a magician whatever you are going to focus upon pisces that's gonna magnify and manifest itself i always tell when it comes to magician it's a very two-edged sword whatever energy that you're going to focus upon is going to magnify so it is for you to mindfully and consciously focus on resolving this untying whatever this knot is so that there is a free flow of energy look through things from an angle that is much needed a perspective that so far you have not looked at this situation through there is a there is an angle there is a lens there is a standpoint that you need to be on so that you can handle this situation whatever that you are not handling so far maybe just acknowledging this that i am running away from something from the past that needs to be handled is what is not letting you get to your dreams to your wish fulfillment look we have the fool five of wands there three of wands there yeah knight of swords as soon as you're going to deal with that inner conflict that you have you're going to be able to take that leap you're going to be able to be on that ship and off you go off you go for a very long-term happiness yes this is going to be long-term whatever this is Pisces, don't doubt it, okay? You have more and enough on your platter. So, there is no way you're going to jinx it. So, deal with the things in the background so that you can enjoy what's in the forefront. Let us get you an oracle guidance message to wrap up this reading. A woman holding a heart there you go address your emotions to align yourself you are so focused on doing that and you will be able to do that just don't be hesitant 
in allowing yourself to feel your feelings fully all of them including this pain number 44 we have there female dealing with family love or emotions the woman on this card wears a butterfly on her hair and holds a lovely large heart in her hands for a woman this card upright could be a reflection of your own state of peaceful emotion and receptivity of love or it might be a message that your family issues are going to resolve you are an intuitive woman who understands the emotions of life and you are bringing that awareness to all that you do this card upright could also indicate a presence of a female friend teacher or confidant who's here to help you with issues of love family or emotions this is an even tempered and caring person who resonates with you and your emotions this could also portend a new love interest or friend coming your way as i said there is love clearly there are new people coming your way new energies in your life that's bringing in a lot of um love and all you need to do is just open up don't be hesitant and on that note my pisces i'm gonna take your leave i thank you all for joining me it's a wrap namaste from the land of gods